Yo guys, what's going on? And welcome back to another video on my channel here. Now in today's video, guys, I'm going to be bringing you an electric money play on offense that can beat defenses in Madden 21 online games. Now quickly, guys, before we do get in the video, if you guys do want to check out my two most recent videos, they are going to be in the top right of the screen now on the card. But guys, without further ado, Let's go ahead and let's move into the pre-play adjustments here for this offense. All right, guys, so here we go. We're going to first touch up on the pre-play adjustments for this offense. Now, in terms of coaching adjustments, you know the drill. If you don't use ball carrier moves such as jukes and spins, just put ball carrier on conservative. Makes your life a lot better. Now, in terms of the play today, we're going to be running out of the gun side doubles formation in the Los Angeles Rams offensive playbook. And the play we're going to be running is going to be mesh spot. Now, quickly, guys, before we before I go on in the pin comment down below, it is going to have all of the playbooks that this uh, on, that this play is in. I know it is in the Raiders playbook, I believe, and also it's obviously in the Rams playbook, but down below in the pinned comment, it's going to have all the playbooks that this is in on offense. Now, in terms of your personnel subs, what you want to do is you just want to make sure here that you have a pretty, that you have your fastest receiver here in this spot as he's going to be on a corner route. So Robert Woods is good, is the fastest receiver on the Rams. So he'll do a pretty good job for this. But if you have like Marquise Goodwin or Tyreek Hill and Rags, you could definitely go ahead and throw them in the spot. And then on this left side you want to make sure that you have your second best or best receiver if your best receiver is not the fastest on the team so we have cooper cup he'll do a pretty good job right here now in turn that's going to be pretty much it here for the pre-play adjustments now we're just going to get into the play we're going to be calling match spot and we're going to be running it running it against a couple of random big nickel over g plays now the first setup right here is just going to be running the play stock. That's literally it. You have some pretty good routes on this play, but then in the second and third adjustments, we're going to be our second and third setups. We're going to be getting into uh, making this offense just a little better. So pretty much right here, we're going to hike the ball and you're going to see that right away. We have RB wide open. If we go for a possession catch right here, you see that he's going to catch it on the sideline. Remember guys for this wheel route, if they give you room on the right side, you got to take it, man. And, you know, Throne says it's too, life to life is too short to check down. You know, I, I think that's kind of false, you know, but pretty much right here. We're just going to run this play. You're going to see once again, we have a wide open on that tight end on the little drag. And you're going to see that we actually shed a few tackles and we're going to burn up field. But now we're going to get into the second setup here. So the second setup, what we're going to do, guys, is we're first going to be streaking the X receiver on that far left side. So how to do that? We're going to press Y, X, and then flick the left stick up. It's going to be on the streak. Next thing we're going to do now is we're going to smart route that corner route on that left side. So we're just going to double tap the Y button and press RB. You see, you see now that it's a lot shorter, but this is actually going to do really good against man coverage. And then the last thing we're going to do, guys, is we're going to block our running back, which is going to be Y, RB, and right trigger. So pretty much right here, this is going to be the setup. Pretty simple. And now we're just going to run it. And you're going to see that A is going to be wide open again underneath on that drag. Kind of gives us a pretty good high-low right here with the corner out as well as that drag. So it does a pretty good job of that. All right, guys. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get into the third setup. Just had to take a little break. I was getting a bit winded. But pretty much right here, what we're going to do for this setup is the first adjustment we're going to make is we're going to be throwing X this time on a flat route. So how to do that, you're going to press Y, X, and then press the left trigger in. You're going to see now it goes on a flat. This is actually going to be really good against really deep coverages such as cover three and cover four palms. And you can on and you and you could go and turn up field for a lot of yards. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna smart route that corner route. So if you forgot how to do it, it's gonna be double tapping Y and pressing that RB button. Then the next thing we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna be throwing the running back here on an option route, which is gonna be Y RB and then the left trigger. And that's pretty much gonna be the setup. Now, also, if you want to, you could throw A and on, on a delay fade, which is gonna be Y, A, and then up on that right stick. But in this case here, we're just gonna leave him on that drag. So pretty much here, this is going to be the setup. We're gonna hike this ball. You're gonna see right here that RB is gonna get wide open on that option route. Kind of gives us a high low on that right side with that deep curl by the B receiver. And then we have that um, option route by the running back. And then remember, if it is man coverage, that option route will turn into an out route. So that actually does a pretty good job of beating man there too. But once again, flat the X receiver, smart route the corner route. 
and then put RB on an option route. Now, the second setup, one, the second setup, guys, was pretty much here streak the X receiver, blocked and blocked the running back. I believe that was the setup. Oh, yeah, in smart route, that corner route, too. So we're just going to hike the ball. You're going to see right here that unfortunately that wide receiver did get a little bit jammed there by one of the linebackers. But as you can see, guys, this play is pretty good. This play is a very, very good base play to sort of work with. You can add it to your scheme if you're running gun side doubles right now, or maybe create a new scheme around it so guys i hope you have enjoyed this video if you did please make sure to smash that like button let's trash my five likes you guys are awesome take care but most importantly stay classy